something that looks out of left field is actually closer to home. This is the team from Knox Incorporated. We're going to kind of go through our daily routine. And the group that uses horticulture as a catalyst for community engagement is actually getting more green. You use different practices for the different areas that you're working out there. With the help of the Hartford Yard Goats. Being that I'm in landscaping, it's like a whole different, like I've never seen like a mower like that, you feel me? The Knox apprentices who work on landscaping projects across the city are upping their game. Just trying to eliminate that thatch. Courtesy of Kyle Calhoun. There's opportunities out there. The Yard Goat Sports Turf Manager. Think of the infield as a sort of outreach program. I had a sports turf manager like myself come to my local high school and give a presentation about, you know, a day in the life of, of a groundskeeper. And flash forward 20 years, you know, here I am managing a field. So if we can influence one kid today to, to maybe look at that as a track of, of learning and education, like that, that would be our goal. So we're here today with our apprentice program and our Knox Green Crew. So what we're trying to do is to get jobs for Hartford City residents and really help boost their skills so they can be really employable in the landscaping industry. Basically for me it's just a learning process, just learning how different materials, like, like different machines, different things is used for like different types of landscaping. And the field work here extends beyond the baselines. Hartford is a village, right? Everybody, it's a great place uh, where everyone can, can come together. Hopefully we can learn something from the way they do things here so we can apply them to when we do it out there. And Knox continues their mission of sprucing up the city. If you want to find out more about their organization, we'll put a link on our website at fox61.com and on the Fox 61 News app. A reminder, opening day, May 11th, here at Dunkin' Donuts Park. In Hartford, Jim Altman, Fox 61 News.